Hi, curl friends, naturally Rhonda here. To all of my old time subscribers, I love you, love you, love you so much. Thank you for coming back to watch my videos each and every week. And if you're new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. Come on in, stay a while, check out some of my other content. If you like this video, then please give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe to my channel by clicking that button down below. So if you've seen my August 2020 Curlbox unboxing video, then you would know that it is Curlbox time. If you haven't seen the unboxing of this month's curl box, then I will leave that down below in the description box as well as up above in the cards. All the products this month came from Dr. Miracles. So I will be doing the log method, leave-in oil gel with their Dr. Miracles Strong and Healthy Shea Butter and Rosemary Length Retention Leave-In Cream. Dr. Miracles Strong and Healthy black castor and tea tree restoring hair and scalp oil and lastly the dr miracles strong and healthy biotin and aloe vera nourishing and styling gel so i've already shampooed detangled and deep conditioned my hair we did not receive a rinse out conditioner first things first my handy dandy spray bottle of water I always like to apply my products on wet hair, especially when this is my first time using a product and I don't know how it's going to perform. All right, so this is what the leave-in looks like. Going in with about this much. It feels creamy. It seems to move through my hair nicely. So the shampoo that came in this box, it was cool, it was all right. It did not lather as much as I prefer shampoos to lather up. That deep conditioner though, that deep conditioner had crazy slip. It was really nice, I enjoyed that. It was definitely something that you would consider a slippery deep conditioner, but you know, it kind of has to be because they did not give us a rinse out conditioner. All right, now I'm gonna go in with some of the oil. Just did a few drops. Ooh. And using an oil in this manner should act as a sealant for my hair and really lock in the moisture. As I mentioned in my previous video, where I discuss various natural hair terminology, there are different types of oils. You can have sealant oils like castor oil, that's a sealant, or you could have moisturizing oils, like say coconut oil, that is a moisturizing oil. A sealant oil will seal in whatever moisture you previously put in it. So this is sealing in the leave-in that I just put in. All right, now I'm going to subsection and go in with the gel. This is what the gel is looking like. It's on the thicker side. Let's see. How she performs. Maybe I should wet my hair down a little bit more. Now I haven't seen what type of hold this gel has. So I guess we just gonna see. And this is just a very light shingling, which is just separating the curls a little. All right, so this is what my first section is looking like. I'm just gonna continue the same steps and I will be back when the product is all in. So I am back. My hair is about 95% dry. It's just my roots are still a little damp. And I'm happy with the results. It's a medium hold for sure. What I'm not happy with is, I'm not sure if the camera is picking it up, but I definitely have flakes. 
Part of that could be user error because I used a lot. So that's what some of it might be. Y'all know I'm the first to say that I am heavy handed. So at first I was going to just be like, eh, whatever. If it's just in this little section, I'll just put some more oil over there and work it out. But then my mom was telling me that it's kind of all over. I'm not sure if y'all can see it in the back. So I'm going to just wash my hair and do a different style. Even though I'm loving the big hair, I just don't really feel like dealing with the flakes. But that's about it for this Curlbox review video. This is the moment in the video where I like to point your attention to some of my other content, like my Natural Club wash and go and my Jane Carter wash and go. I love you for watching y'all. Please be safe out there and I'll see you in the next one.